Hello everyone. I wanted to share with you a script that I made recently. Um, what it does is it basically scans your ship and uh, displays an output of that scan um, on the screen and it'll scan cross sections of your ship and animate it. Um, so I just want to show you how it works real quick. Um, basically the, the setup's really easy. All you need is a programming block with my script, an LCD panel that's named LCD1, if you're a clever programmer, you can figure out how to change that. Uh, and a timer block. Um, so all we need to do is just go to our timer block, uh, set up the actions. I've already got it set to run the programming block. There are no arguments. Uh, and just trigger itself. And uh, if we start that, uh, basically it takes a little time. Oh, I have to turn the timer block on. Uh, so we turn that on. Uh, it's going to take a little time to scan the ship in and then it'll start rendering it so oh actually sorry it had already scanned it in um, but as you can see it does three different views the side view the front view and the top view um, this works with any ship without you know needing to do a whole lot of changing um, as you can see it's, it's kind of like an MRI scan um, but basically we can uh, we can do it there um, I'm going to toggle that off for a second, and I'll show you an extreme example. So that was with the red ship. Uh, the red ship's kind of getting up towards uh, this script's potential for sizes of ships, but I wanted to show you on the green station, because it is also possible. It's pretty slow, but it is possible to do here, so I'm just going to toggle this on. As you can see, we're taking quite a performance hit in the game here, especially l rendering this long angle. And uh, the station, you know, looks kind of funny. Um, just because it's such a spread out kind of object, you don't really get a very good coherent view in any of the renders. But, you know, it's kind of what it's inbound. like. I'm going to stop that since it's killing performance. And I'll show you an example of just one more ship. So for the future of this script, uh, something I'm hoping that it'll do is uh, it'll be able to show you where your ship is damaged. So it'll... Um, you know, render render parts of your ship slightly differently depending on whether or not they are uh, missing. So, like, it'll show red in place of white uh, or something like that. But I, I think we're going to need to wait for more drawing options before that happens. Right now I'm using Cyrillic characters and spaces to, uh, to draw the ship. So I'm just going to toggle this on. This is what the blue ship looks like when you scan through it. And I'm just going to um, edit this. I'm just going to add a useless comment here to basically make it so it has to rescan the ship from scratch. So we'll do that and see it scans through it here. It scans it pretty quickly. It doesn't, doesn't take very long at all. Um, and then it, it just runs. Works with small, small ships too. Um, I don't have any really big small ships that it would be fun to show. But uh, yeah, that's, that's essentially it. Thanks for watching. Oh, um, I'm not going to upload, well, I might upload this to the workshop. I, I don't really feel like it's totally polished and ready for that yet. Um, if, if you guys want me to, I, I can, but, um, or I can just share the raw script. Um, but I don't think I'm going to upload it to the workshop yet until uh, I've completed more work on it. That's just sort of a, a sneak peek. Um, and that's it. Thanks for watching.